And today is a big day for holiday travel. Mother Nature really not doing us any favors. CBS 3 Avenue News reporter Crystal Cranmore is live at Philadelphia International Airport, where some people there are dealing with delays. Hi, Crystal. Good morning, Rahel. Well, as expected, anxiety is a little high here at the Philadelphia International Airport because instead of being home with loved ones, there are people here waiting on their flights. Now, flights have been delayed all morning, as you can see behind me. According to Flight Aware, a flight tracking service, there are about 14,000 delays nationwide. At last check, Philadelphia International Airport had 79 delays and seven cancellations. Airport officials say if you're traveling, allow extra time to park, check in, and go through TSA. Now, the delays weren't just a headache for travelers, but for families who could not wait to embrace their loved ones. Here's video that we just shot moments ago of military military men and women returning home. Now, we talked to one family who was waiting for their granddaughter to arrive. She's training to become a military police officer. It's just so emotional. I just can't wait to see her. She's been in our life forever, and just seeing her on Facebook and everything now that Fort Leonard Wood does, it's very, very, uh, I don't know, getting emotional again. But seeing all these other families here, too, as well, you know, just the anticipation. Now, again, you want to make sure that you're planning extra time before your flights and check with the airlines to make sure that your flight is not delayed and canceled. And if you're traveling with gifts, TSA also recommends that you do not wrap them because, of course, they may have to unwrap them if it doesn't comply with TSA rules. We're at PHL tonight. Crystal Cranmore, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. A lot of emotional reunions there. Crystal, thank you.